Ушли и морда. Lightweight division bout. Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right Okay, protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting, and it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Nice. And he landed the right hand there. Right back in the clinch. Look for the backhand to get very active. Oh! Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. Went for the inside leg kick. That's a perfect scramble right there. Beautiful transition. That was snuck in. Nice strike. He is all about that left kick to the body. Able to check that kick as well. Right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Powerful leg kick lands. Misses with the left hook. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Big punch lands through the middle. And they separate. Oh, lands a left punch there, and a lot of it's set up by good footwork. Really great footwork and setting traps so they can land that beautiful left hand. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. All right, single collar tie now. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Punch to the body is blocked. Lee gets hit with a kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Ooh, big shot land. His head still attached to his body. The last time I saw an uppercut like that, it was Overeem versus Ngannou. And you know they still haven't found Alistair Overeem's head. Starting to see some of the damage cut underneath that right eye. Straight punch is going to be a real problem if they can't make the adjustment. A real problem. He needs to move his head defensively if he's going to avoid getting hit so many times to the face. Good series of strikes for him there. Staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Slips that left hand. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Look at him flip his hip into that kick. Oh, and he caught the kick. Plus right hand is true. All right, so he lands his first takedown of the fight after many failed attempts, so he stayed committed. Now he has the... Lee's got his head. Let's see if he can secure a guillotine choke here. Watch guillotine. There it is. Oh, what a beautiful counter to the guillotine there. Gets side mount. 
And now maybe the Von Flute choke will be there. Open St. Prune has got to like that transition there. Wow. All right, full guard now, DC. The fighter on top needs to be trying to gain posture to throw ground and pound and then move to the next position. But if you're on the bottom, you've got to build a shield. Try to push your opponent off to try to get back to your feet. Crazy accuracy and efficiency with these ground and pound strikes here. And if you're the opponent, you've got to intelligently defend or the referee's going to stop him. got to defend. But you can see him now starting to gain posture and the intensity at which he's throwing these ground strikes is starting to improve. It's starting to elevate because he knows that he can get the pitch. Takedown defense holds up. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those legs. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that round. Ended, nearly got the finish, too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. Some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, spinning back fist out of nowhere. Oh, big punch land. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Nice job with that follow-up shot as well. Single collar tie here. The biggest shot that he's landed all night. A massive uppercut land. He blocks the punch. Man, that cut has really opened up. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this? Landed that left hook. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. Thank you. That is a stiff jab. Big kick land. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. He's hurt. He's hurt. Big ball punch land. Now we'll get back to range. Back to the feet now. Ball oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Catches the leg here and now goes for the takedown. It's there. Got the single collar guy. Those punches to the body are really starting to take its toll. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch, though. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. He's throwing bombs. Every time they come into contact, he is throwing bombs. Beautiful body kiss. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Ooh, blocks the shot. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's a great player. He's out! He's done, he's done! You knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was 
just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 13 seconds of round number two. Going the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, so there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything he needed to do 